Good morning. Welcome to Martinsburg Grace Brethren Church. It's great to have you worshiping with us today. In the pew rack in front of you is a card looks just like this. If you're visiting with us for the very first time, if you would complete that card, drop it into the offering plate, and uh, we'd just like a record of your visit. And again, thanks for worshiping with us this morning. The Christmas Cantata, Child of Wonder, is coming up Saturday, December the 12th at 7 o'clock. It'll then be performed the following morning at 10.30, following the morning worship service, and again over at Homewood on December the 22nd at 7 o'clock. Just a reminder, Kids Chorale will be performing tonight, Rapping All the Way, at 6.30 tonight here in the Worship Center. Please invite your family and friends and neighbors to come to hear Rapping All the Way. Just a reminder that this is the final week for Wheels of Joy, so if you're going to take a tag off the tree, purchase a bike or uh, other items for the children for the Wheels of Joy program, this is your final week to do that. Just remember this year we'll also be doing the Christmas card exchange. Simply write out your Christmas card, put the name on the outside of the envelope, and drop it in the appropriate box by the last name, and we'll make sure that it gets to the person that you want to wish a Merry Christmas. Pastor Tim is in the process of setting up a baby and child dedication. That'll be held February the 21st. Now, parents, if you would like to have a baby or child dedicated, contact Pastor Tim or Rachel in the church office by January the 3rd. As you saw last week, MGBC will be sending a team to Haiti and in the process of raising funds. If you would like to give directly to those individuals going to a Haiti missions trip, please fill out uh, the offering envelope. You can simply write on the outside for the Haiti missions team and put your check inside. Also, as a reminder, today is the Haiti team's fundraising meal at Hosses in Duncansville. Simply go there today, present this to your server, and 10% of your bill will go to the Haiti missions team fundraising efforts. All right, good morning. Today is December, so it's the beginning of the new winter quarter for Sunday school classes. Our kids are going to be switching their study to begin the book of Matthew, and they're going to study the first 13 chapters of Matthew this quarter. If you're interested in the family reading guide, we will have those on the information desk today. You'll also notice that there are some new faces in our Sunday school classes today. We have several new teachers that are starting today, so kids, make sure you make your teachers feel welcome, and parents, uh, make sure you say hello to the new teachers that your children will have today. We also have some changes coming to Children's Church today. Preschoolers, you stay where you're at. There's no changes to the preschool children's church. Elementary kids are going to a new location today. So when the pastors dismiss you, you head out the same door that you did before and you walk down this hallway. When you get to this point, this is where we'll separate. Big kids, grades three, four, and five, you're gonna go upstairs to the upper room and that's where you'll have children's church. Younger kids, kindergarten, first, and second grade will go straight through into the multi-purpose room and you'll have children's church in the big room now so you'll have a little bit more space to move around. Sunday school teachers for the kids, make sure you're aware of this change because you'll need to pick up your kids in a different location today. Um, teachers of the older kids, please come upstairs and you can come in the doors and just wait in the back of the room for us to be ready and we'll dismiss the kids with you. Younger kids teachers, you'll need to come down to the multi-purpose room to pick up your class and then walk them up to your Sunday school class. And parents, if you are planning to leave after church and not stay for Sunday school, make sure you let your children know that and they can wait with me on the stage of the multi-purpose room and you can find all ages of your kids there. One other note, uh, the Sunseekers Sunday School class that meets in the multi-purpose room, we're going to ask for your patience the next couple weeks as we make some changes and tweak this and make sure that the kids, Sunday, the kids are getting to their Sunday School classes okay. We're going to start closing these doors um, outside of the multi-purpose room lobby so that we have some extra space to bring the kids down from the upper room. So we're going to ask that you wait out here in the lobby until the children's church teacher actually opens this door and that'll be your cue that the room is empty and then you can come in. So thank you for helping us. I hope you are enjoying uh, service today. Just have a couple of announcements uh, for you. If you are in sixth to eighth grade, we have cell group today from four to six at Bob and Barb Ferries. And if you are in our senior high uh, age group from ninth to 12th grade, we have cell groups from six to eight over at Brad and Heidi Stearns. If you are a guy, please bring a drink. If you are a girl, please bring a snack. Our Christmas mystery meal will be December 22nd. That's a Tuesday from 6 to 9. Uh, meet at Shoop Lodge that evening and bring her $5 ahead of time in the next couple of weeks and deliver that money to Becky Culp. 
the winter retreat is going to be a camp mana wagon this year it's going to be from january 22nd to the 24th uh, it's going to be 7th to 12th graders this year the cost is going to be 50 dollars uh, we need you to write a check and when you write that check make it out to mgbc and put in the memo put in the memo line winter retreat and the registration form is going to be online just a reminder that today at two o'clock there'll be a, a rehearsal for the christmas orchestra so if you're interested in being in that that's for concert band instruments like flute trumpet clarinet stuff like that um, so again two o'clock this afternoon if you need more information talk to me or ellen stuckey after the service this morning if you're with us last week, you know that pastoral evaluations for Pastor Brian were handed out at the service. If you've completed one and want to hand that in, there is a box available outside the center doors. You can do that after our service this morning. Um, also, if you are a regular attender of our church or a member and would like to pick one of those up, there are some additional ones available at the information desk. As you know, our birthday for Jesus offering is coming up December 20th and the 27th. One of the organizations that you'll have the opportunity to give to is Destiny Rescue. Here's a video outlining their ministry. 